Hello Magic fans! Welcome to another unboxing video. So I thought I was opening my last uh, Phyrexia All Will Be One set booster <laughs> a while back. But I got roped into getting this box from my local game store, uh, Neutral Grounds. So yeah, <laughs> I guess we'll open it up and, and see what we get. So Phyrexia All Will Be One has been out for, uh, I don't know, two, three weeks? Two weeks? <laughs> Uh, at this point and you know all of the spoilers or previews or something for some of the new sets has started so March of the Machines I've seen some information about uh, a commander master set and I've also seen some information about the Lord of the Rings set coming you know later this year uh, that one i'm i'm very hopeful for i hope it's a good set i am a big fan of lord of the rings but we'll, we'll see how it goes i was very disappointed with the commander legend battle for Baldur's gate but mostly i think because of how they they package the set and what in and you know there weren't really any significant reprints in the set but it was a fun set to play. I, I, I give them that. But anyway, let's go with Phyrexia. All will be one. So let's open up. For first card, uh, first mythic is Zopandrel, Hunger Dominus. Yeah, that's it for this pack. We get a card from the list. It's Baldin, Century Herdmaster. And we get a Soulless Jailer. As well as a Sky Hunter Strike Force from the Commander cards. I'm going to do this to make it go a little bit faster. We get a Unctus Grand Metatect in foil, foil rare, a Phyrexian Arena, hmm. we get a Ajani's Last Stand from the list, a Argentum Masticor, and a Ovika Enigma Goliath Showcase, maybe? <laughs> I'm not sure. Uh, okay. Ooh, we get a Drivenod, our second mythic for this box. Okay. Let, let me adjust a little bit. Go. We get a monumental facade. Oh, send signed art card. Slow bad. Red Sun's Twilight, Foil Rare, a Dragonwing Glider. Dark Slick Shores, and a Venser Corpse Puppet. We get a Black Cleave Cliffs. Okay. 
Get a Red Sun's Twilight. Ooh, Eternal Wanderer. A Sea Chrome Coast and a Rook. Hex Gold Nabber. We get a Sethi Arcane Blade Master from the list. Blue Sun's Twilight. A lo Lose Hope from the list. Bloated Contaminator, a Capricious Hellraiser, Mythic, third Mythic from the list. Oh, sorry, not from the list, from the, the showcase lot. Benser, Corpse Puppet, Green Sun's Twilight. Have we completed all the Twilights again? Ooh, Luca, Luca Bound to Ruin. Sorry, Fourth Mythic. <laughs> Hoping for a Concept Praetor. Zenith Chronicler A Malkator Purity Overseer and a Might Overseer Okay, last 10 packs Ovika. Ah, Elish Norn. We get a Thran War Machine from the list. Ooh, and a Foil Seachrome Coast. Nice. And a Mondrak Glory Dominus. Oh, that's a nice pack. Yes, please. We have a Karumonix, the Rat King. We get a Soul of New Phyrexia from the list. A Venser Corpse Puppet Foil. A Miran Store Safe House Foil. And a Melura the Living Cure in the borderless version. Which I call the anime. <laughs> Anime art version of the card. Those are quite nice. I do like them a lot. I think we're down to our last six packs. So, Black Sun Twilight. I believe that completes our Twilight series. And then a Azuri, Stalker of Spheres. And then a Jor Kadeen. First Gold Warden, again the border of frame. A vindicative, vindictive flame stoker. Tablet of Completion. Then last two packs.
cost fire of resistance and last pack for this box we get a scrib ranger from the list a jorkadeen and that's it so recap hold on so we get a mondrak a Luca, a Capricious Hellraiser, a Drivnod, and a Zopandrel. Uh, five mythics for the box. We did get a bunch of um, foil rares. So we get um, a Venser, a Sea Chrome Coast, uh, full art. We also had a Red Sun's Twilight. And the Unctus Grand Metal Tech. Unfortunately, <laughs> no Rot Priest. And from the list, this is what we got. We get two cards from the Street Fighter uh, in universe version. Oh, I, I, and I completely missed it. This was a signed art card. Yep, so that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.